I'm going to show you guys how to use a mini dispensing pin for reconstitution and using a large vented dispensing pin for withdrawing from a bag. So the first thing I'm going to do is drop my diluent and put needles on all my syringes. So I'm going to drop my sterile water using a needle and syringe. I'm going to draw up 10 mils of sterile water. Next, I'm going to take my drug file. Hold it three times. And let it dry. Once dry, I'm going to put my dispensing pin into the vial. Now to recon, the first thing I'm going to do I'm going to put an alcohol swab on the work surface, unscrew the cap of the fill port of the dispensing pin, and attach my syringe. After adding my diluent, I'm going to reattach the cap and shake my vial until it is dissolved. I can also use my dispensing pin now to draw up the 10 mils of medication that I need. And it just screws on. Make sure not to add any air into the vial when using a dispensing pin as it'll plug the vent. reattach the cap and put it to the side. Now to use the large vented dispensing pin for removing volume from 
a mini bag or other infusion bag. You're going to take the cap off the medication administration port. You're gonna push in and twist at the same time. You wanna make sure it's in there far enough, otherwise when withdrawing volume, you'll be withdrawing air if it's not high enough in the administration port. I'm going to remove my cap and attach my syringe. You need to lift your bag up in order to withdraw. You can shoot that excess air back into the bag. With this, you do not need to add air into the bag prior to withdrawing. I'm gonna draw it 40 mils. That is how you use both the large vented dispensing pin as well as the mini dispensing pin.